What causes pneumonia? I'd like to speak with you just briefly about this. So some of the causes are viruses, bacteria, parasites, although that could be rare. Um, you have uh, bacteria and viruses that are most prevalent uh, with strep is a bacteria, staph is a bacteria. Flu can be either one, a bacteria or a virus. Uh, they got the Legionella, and you have bird droppings and fungi. Pneumonia is usually initiated when somebody's breathing in infected air, so it's airborne. Uh, you can develop by doing or after uh, upper respiratory infections, such as a cold or a flu. Um, complications of viral illnesses, measles, chickenpox, aspiration, pneumonia is when they, someone uh, maybe should was vomiting and aspirates it into their lungs and will develop into a pneumonia. Not all the time, but it can develop into pneumonia and it's very acid coming out of the stomach contents. So that's going to be a pretty um, heavy pneumonia that can be aspirated. Uh, it's airborne. It's uh, also many times uh, people will get a pneumonia that has a compromised immune system, whether it's AIDS or HIV positive, or it's whether it's an elderly person with chronic lung disease, or has just been debilitated for a long time. But sometimes you'll see with, with people who have had a, a long-term illness, it's uh, easier to get a pneumonia. Uh, you see a lot of it in uh, perhaps um, in the hospitals if the patient is not turned as much as um, every two hours, hopefully, uh, minimum where that the fluid seg uh, just gets into certain areas of the lung and it can cause a sedimentary uh, pneumonia. Um, however, uh, some of the things that you want to look for with this is that it comes from viruses, bacteria, and parasites. Uh, so that just concludes on what causes pneumonia.